Hey guys, this is Fireworks Tutorial, and in this video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to attach an icon to your website. And so a lot of people have been asking me about this and how I can attach it to a UCOS site. And it's this little icon here next to the link. And what the correct term for this is actually called a favicon. And I'll show you guys real quick how you can attach that, and it'll only take a few minutes. So basically, that's what I'm going to be showing you how to add that little icon your custom icon to your site okay so first off what you're going to be needing is actually an icon itself and this is my little image here i whipped it up in fireworks and you guys can make this really simply using gimp photoshop whatever program you have possibly even paint and yeah just make it real quick and the size i do recommend you guys choosing a size around 50 by 50 because if you go up to like 500 by 500 you're going to get into all these detail and what's going to happen is uh, when you attach it to your site it's just going to turn it into this tiny like 10 by 10 pixel little image here and you're not even going to see the details so just make it small and simple on yourself okay so once you're done with that once you've got your image what you want to do is go to a site called convertiCon.com. the link will be in the description of this video and hit get started Okay, so what you want to do is go click on this pop down plus and hit image, and you'll just find your icon image there. And then we'll just select our icon and hit export. And right here, there will be a few sizes that you guys can choose. I do recommend 24 by 24 and save as. And we'll just save this icon file onto your desktop. Okay, so what's going to happen is what you want to do to your icon is rename your icon to favicon. And yeah, just simply that's how you spell it. And make sure it's a favicon.ico. Make sure that's its name. And now what you want to do is go onto your UCOS control panel and go to file manager. And here, what we're just going to simply do is browse through our image and upload the favicon file. Once you've got that, hit upload file and it's just going to replace the old favicon image and what's going to happen is you're just going to wait uh, possibly a few hours to days for your icon to actually change. And I'm not sure if mine, no, mine's not going to change after until after a few hours. So yeah, just make sure to wait till then and it should be all set. Okay, I just wanted to show you guys real quick that the favicon now does work after waiting for like around three hours or so. Um, the new one actually showed up on the site and yeah, so simple as that. That's how it's going to work out and if this video helped you guys out, make sure to thumbs up the video and also comment below and yeah, really simple process. And so that's basically it. Have a wonderful day guys.